Westchester on top. R.J. Hunter slashes in from the right side, gets to the rim and puts it home. One-on-one -on -one against Cornett, goes down the lane, falls down, it was blocked by Zimmerman. Here comes Jenkins, he can't handle it in midcourt. Hunter lobs it ahead, Sword all by himself, lays it in with the left hand for the Hawks as he sends it over to Jeremy Hollowell. And now Hunter works his way down the lane, a lot of contact, Hicks knocked him to the floor, no call, and he made the layup anyway. One left side, Fallon extended, works against Kadeem Allen. And now Hunter steps back. He'll hoist a three-pointer, and he hits it. We might soon see Alex Poitras for the first time in Erie this season. Adams with a three from the right wing, knocks it down. Seven offensive boards already. Here's Gillen in the lane, shut off by Jenkins, kicks it to Hunter up top. Adams left alone, right wing three, got it. It was a late scratch with an ankle injury. He was shooting around. I noticed he shot a couple of air balls, and then he... Just said he couldn't do it as Hunter knocks down a three. So 10 to shoot it for the Hawks. Hunter down the lane, somehow got it to Humphreys. He's gonna try a right corner three and he got it. Made 12, so 48%. But Cornett tonight just 0 of 1 from beyond the arc. Speaking of threes, there's RJ Hunter who now has 19 points. Suddenly finding themselves leading for the first time tonight. Hunter, tough three left side hits. He's got talcum powder all over the place, a shaving kit. Gillen gets loose and lays it in. Nine points for John Gillen. Says that they're down by eight. Adams with another three. This one's off the mark. Hunter with the offensive rebound, lays it in with the left hand. So it's a six-point game with 15 seconds left. As Jenkins puts it in play along the left sideline. And it's stolen by Hunter. Hunter breaks out of the pack across midcourt. Of course, they're down by seven.